Hey, it's Holly and welcome to Living It Country. Today we're gonna to be doing a DIY wall makeover in our kids' bathroom. And we decided to set up everything outside of our home to make our house a little bit more tidier during the DIY process. And we have found this extremely helpful and highly recommend it if you're ever doing a DIY project. Now we're starting this project off with some base trim and we're also going to be doing some door trim as well. Now this video is going to be a no budget DIY project. And what I mean by that is everything is things we already have left over from other projects. And so we are spending zero dollars this weekend accomplishing projects around our home. I highly encourage you guys to try this, try to reuse the things you already have, try to use items you already have. And so that way you stay on budget and you can get some things done in your home that look beautiful um, without breaking the bank. Now here we are starting with the shiplap. If you guys have watched our previous videos, one I highly recommend is our new DIY fireplace video. I will put that in the links down below. And um, we have a really cool hack for saving on shiplap. I know a lot of people do the Sharpie shiplap or they'll get the thin wood and those are great options. But if you're looking for the real shiplap, always check the damaged wood section because Home Depot, Lowe's, they will put in perfectly wonderful shiplap that maybe the edges are just cracked or little imperfections. They'll put it in there up to 70% off, which is a huge savings over a long period of time. First piece of shiplap is in. Now, while my hubby is busting away installing the shiplap, I am going to be filling all the holes in. We kind of have a great system down where we are able to work really, really well together and we kind of know our jobs and it has really been beneficial for both of us to get these projects done a little bit faster, a little bit more efficiently so we can spend that quality um, time as a family. And so we wanna to get to a point where our weekends are not spent doing DIY projects and we can use that time to really soak in the family time and so we did stop and um, take many, many breaks to play with our kids. And we also got our kids involved as well, even with the simplest tasks as practicing using the drill, which you guys will see a little later with our kids. And um, not only do they love learning, but they love feeling like they're helping and contributing to our family, which I think is really special and really fun too. Now typically our DIY accent walls take us no time at all, but this one actually took us all day and it's because we had the vanity in front as well as the electrical and that made a little bit of a difference in the timing of how fast we could get this project done as well as there being no base trim and no door trim. And we also had a um, situation where our pocket door, our Kit for that didn't come in time so we needed to make sure that we did that carefully so we didn't have to redo the trim now we're going to be taking off the lighting we turned off the electricity so this would be safe for my husband and he's going to be cutting a circular shape in the shiplap and while he does that i'm going to be cleaning this lighting kit with my new blue land multi-surface spray and if you guys have not heard of blue land before they are awesome and they're actually partnering with us on today's video which i am so excited about now if you're a shark tank fan like me you've probably heard of blue land before they not only were featured in an episode but they actually landed a deal with one of the sharks which is so cool and if you haven't heard of them before i'm so excited for you i fall in love with them how much it saved me and the convenience of it going directly to my door too. Unlike other liquid cleaners that are sold in single use plastic, all you need to clean your house is one of these nickel sized tablets. Gone are the days of throwing away your money with throwing away the plastic bottles. With Blue Land, it's just $2 a tablet and $2 is how much we already pay for our drip coffee at a coffee stand if you are just like me. And if you buy these tablets in bulk, it's as low as $1.54 and all of that really adds up. 
All you need to do is fill your bottles with warm water, drop in a tablet, wait, and you can use it in a few minutes. I got the Clean Essentials Kit, which is a 20% savings, and it comes with multi-surface spray, glass and window spray, bathroom spray, and hand soap. And instead of buying individual cleaning products, you can get a kit all ready for 20% off, plus I have a coupon code for you that saves an additional 15% off. So go ahead and check my link in the description box below and add that code LIVING so you guys can save that 15%. And a big thank you to Blue Land for partnering with us on today's video. I don't have any electricity right now in the bathroom, but I want to show you guys what the shiplap is looking like. I am obsessed. I wish I could have shiplap down this hallway and just in every room. I absolutely love it. So I'm going to show you guys the update of what it's looking like. Okay, here it is. So Jason just finished making that hole right there for our light. We're going to keep the original light that we had in here. Um, I really love it. I just don't think this room was highlighting it very well. It's actually right here. I just don't think it was highlighting it very well since we had nothing in the background. So I'm really excited. We're going to keep this a bright white, the same as the trim. And then this is going to be um, this whitish green look. So that's the update. Here is a progress shot for you guys. I'm super obsessed with the way it looks. And if I had it my way, I would probably shiplap my whole home, my hallway, not my whole home, but like the hallway areas. There are so many different things that we've learned through the DIY projects that I would just do a tad different. And it's so exciting to learn and just explore um, different creativity through all these DIY projects. So I would love to know though, in the comment section down below, do you guys have a problem with a lot of dinks in your drywall because one of the reasons I love getting accent walls is because it hides those imperfections that the drywall just doesn't. So let me know if I'm alone on that or let me know if you guys have that problem too. So now we have electricity. We're adding that vanity back in. I'm obsessed with this vanity. Um, I don't know if they, if they sell it any longer, um, but it was a Walmart find, which how cool is that? So I love that barn X look. It's really, really cute. And then we got our mirror from actually Walmart as well from the Better Homes and Garden um, line. And they do sell them on eBay still, um, but you can't find them at Walmart anymore, which is really, really unfortunate. I'm going crazy. Like, what's the deal? Because I want you to show me what you feel. You're watching me like you want me, but you still hold Now I'm just working on decorating this space and although this was just a DIY uh, wall makeover, I like showing you guys the final touches of what it's going to look like every day and we're going to work on this side wall as well, adding a few pieces of decor that I had um, hanging around and you guys will hear about it in this little tour that I'm going to give you guys right now. Okay friends, I'm going to give you guys a little tour, talk a little bit about today's project which is this DIY shiplap wall. We did a whole project today. Our deal was that we were going to spend zero dollars. So everything that we did today was a zero dollar budget. So this shiplap wall, which I am so happy about, I wish we could do our whole home with shiplap, not just accent walls. Um, but this was left over from our DIY fireplace 
um, that we did. Goodness, it took us quite a few months, but it's a great video if you guys want to check that out. And a large majority of that um, DIY fireplace was done with shiplap that was up to 70% off. Um, the others, we actually had to travel about an hour away to get shiplap from. So these, this was the leftover of that. So we didn't have to go to Home Depot or anything like that for this. Um, so like I said, the idea behind this video was a no spend project. Um, we have these beautiful light switches that we added. This is like a really cottagey look and we had extra of these as well, which was really, really great. And a nice surprise that my husband um, found in the garage. And we have our blue lantern soap. And then I love, love, love this little riser that looks um, like a cutting board. I bought that from Antique Farmhouse a long time ago. Um, actually, I think it was decor steals. It was either decor steals or antique farmhouse, but it came in a four pack. And then I have my mango citrus antique candle co candle. I love this smell. I love, love their summer smells. They are absolutely my favorite. So I have that in here. So the room smells so lovely. And then I bought this powder room sign probably over a year and a half ago, I would say. So this was from Target and I think I got it on sale for $9.99 or $14.99. And then these I actually have had for since my daughter was born. So five and a half years and I had this really cute, cute sign that I made and it said Aria, Holly, and Jason on it. Well, the opposite, Jason, Holly, Aria. And it said towel rack and it was in our tiny cottage and so I actually, um, when we had our son, I thought, oh, I gotta get something for my son. So I ended up taking it all apart and just using these. So we have one of these in mine in my husband's bathroom. And I thought these other two would be great for both of my kids in here to hang their towels. So that is this little area. One of my favorite things about this vanity. This is a Walmart vanity. We love it really really cute it's like a grayish blue color and I got these beautiful little knobs from an Etsy shop I'll link them down below but it says try our farm fresh cream and it's so cute we have knobs like this in our bathroom too so this is also a Walmart mirror it's $30 and they sold out of these like hot cakes back when we first uh, built our home three and a half years ago and they have not returned so it's a better homes and garden one and I have seen a few people sell them on eBay for much more, but we love, love this. So this was our no spend DIY project, you guys. I hope you enjoyed today's video so, so much. And I can't wait to take you guys along more DIY projects in our home to complete our home and make it just feel so cozy and homey. And I hope you guys can get inspired too. If you guys attempt to do a no spend DIY where you just use things that are already in your house or your garage, let me know because I would love to share a photo of it on our Instagram stories. And I will see you guys later on Living It Country. Bye.